Tell me you have cretan parents without actually telling me you have cretan parents. I'll go first. So this is what happens when you are your parents' favorite child. Not to brag, but hello! This arrived today, let me show you individually. So first of all, we have three packs of giant-sized beans and you can make lovely, delicious and very traditional Greek dishes with those. Then we have um, a very Cretan product. I don't know how to translate this in English, but in Greek it is Xinochodros and is made from milk and some kind of wheat in a procedure that I don't know, but it's amazing. You can put it in soups and you can make like some kind of stews with it and it's very, very nutritious. And then we move on to these two bad boys, which is two packs of Cretan traditional sausage. You cannot find this anywhere else but Crete. You know, Cretan sausage is way better than any other sausage. This is a smoked one and is cooked in vinegar. Very traditional. Then we have this one, which is pancetta, but it's smoked pancetta with honey from thyme. Yum! I cannot wait to eat this. Moving on, we have this, which is another very traditional and cretan type of meat. So this is pork, um, but it's smoked and it has a very strong flavor of vinegar. Um, I don't know how exactly to translate this, let's see. Smoked pork tenderloin fillet, yum. Then we're moving on, we have Greek coffee maker because if I've missed something from Greece is Greek coffee and I cannot wait to try this. Then we have Greek coffee Hello! Moving on, we have five <laughs> jars of honey and this is not labeled because this is my family's honey, my dad makes it. Well, actually his bees, but oh well, I cannot wait. Tahini spread with cacao and praline, this one, nucrema. And then we move on to this one, which is another traditional thing. Um, I don't know how to translate this. It says here, sweet with mastic flavor, mastic. So we put it under water and yeah, it's nice. <laughs> it's like icing, sugar, but thicker. And then we have three Greek chocolates. This is dark one with red fruits and hazelnuts. In Greece, we really love strawberries with chocolate. This is another amazing Greek chocolate, Lacta, and it has Lila Pau's flavor. And another dark chocolate, because my mom knows how much I love dark chocolate, with strawberry cream flavor. And then we have this. Don't see the ugly packaging? Inside there is something very homemade from my mom. So this is a kind of dry sweet bread made from something that I cannot translate in English. It's very nutritious and we use this thing to make a supplement for coffees as well. Or even honey. We, uh, you can find like honey made from this thing that I cannot translate. I'll find it and I will put it in the video but this will go great with my coffee. And then we have tsureki. I cannot wait to get my hands on this. Let me show you. It's like brioche, but it's a very traditional treat that we have. Uh, we eat it usually Christmas, Easter, it's lovely. And you can get many flavors of this. You can get a flavor with chocolate or um, white chocolate and chestnut. This is just a plain one, which I love. And then we have 10 liters of olive oil because, you know, Cretans love olive oil. And then I would like to show you this beautiful thing over here. This is the reason why I love Cretan culture and Cretan cuisine so much, because this is a, a homemade hair treatment. So this is made from coconut milk, castor oil, oil from almonds, um, Daphne? It's in Greek, but I don't remember how to translate this in English. And the drolivano. Oh, oh my god. I cannot wait to put this on my hair. I love this so much because in Crete and in Cretan culture, we love homemade things. We love things that are made from nature 
and Mother Nature is our best friend in Crete. And that's it. And if you think that this is too extra, oh my god, this is just a normal size parcel from Crete. I cannot wait to try all those things. So, after all, Christmas came very early for me. <laughs> Bye!